Welcome to episode three of GeoGuessr. Um, I am a level six tourist, and um, today we're going to start with um, famous places. We're going to get out of the U.S. where we've been the first couple episodes, and we're going to see uh, where we can go around the world. Although it's possible that these famous places could be all in the U.S., but I doubt it. Okay, first famous place. Oh, here we go. Oh, gee, what could this be? Um, it is the Grand Canyon. The question is, where in the Grand Canyon is it? It's a bench in the Grand Canyon. Let's see if there's a signage up here. Welcome to the Trail of Time. Okay, is that an actual name or is it just referring to... Donations appreciated. You are here. That doesn't help me an awful lot, does it? Um, like I said, we know we're at the Grand Canyon, but how far is this from, you know, like a, a lodge, an office, a parking lot, something like that. It's the, uh, South Rim is the, is generally where most of the tourists go. Yeah, this is... I have not been to the Grand Canyon for about 18 years. Um, I'm going to be way off from... You know what, let's start on the map, see what we come up with. So here's the visitor center. I, I'm, I'm assuming it's somewhere around here. I hate to be way off, but I'm going to look a little bit longer to see if I can find something. But if not, we're just going to kind of do a general guesstimate. Well, this looks like parking over here. And I'm not going to be able to go to the parking lot. Okay, so I think that this is the, uh, this is near the visitor center. I don't think it's right at it because if I remember right, there's actually like a um, there's like a fence. Yeah, I think it's like along here. All right, we're gonna take a wild ass guess and just hope for the best. Yeah, a mile. Okay. It was on the South Rim Trail. At least I had the very general area, but it wasn't over here. Here's the parking lot here, so it was a smaller lot. Um, we didn't see the museum, so... Oh well, that's kind of a hit in points, but I'll take it. It's all right. Um, I actually did enjoy the location, so I'm going to start marking those up. What were the main reasons I liked it? Uh, scenic views. All right, next round. Okay, um, this one looks very familiar to me. I do believe that these are ferries. This is New York. And I do believe there's the bridge over there. I don't know if that's the Verrazano Narrows or the Cuomo Bridge or whatever the hell they call it now. But I do believe this is the Statue of Liberty uh, uh, Park. Um, that's not there. 
Um, but I'm pretty sure that's what this is. Um, since we can move, I'm going to go over here just to make sure that, yeah, I, this looks very familiar. That the uh, statues around here, um, that's like the visitor center. Yeah, there it is right there. We just saw the arm. Let's go back here so I can show you. No, map. There it is right there. There's Lady Liberty's arm. So uh, that looks like it's behind her. So we're over here at the... I guess this would be the ferry terminal or whatever. Yeah, we were right about here. So let's go to New York. Um, there's Bayonne, Statue of Liberty. Zoom in here. Yeah, it's here's the ferry terminal. Here's the statue. We were walking along this little trail here. Um, there's the cafe. So we're right on this path, so I gotta assume we're right here. Um, well, here's the terminal, so we're like right here. Boom, 15 yards. It's odd when it does that, and it shows you that it's actually in the water, but yeah, whatever. Um, yeah, I enjoyed this one too. Uh, but, 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 what do we like about it? For me, it was easy to pinpoint, but 5,000 points. Round three of five. And what do we have out here? <laughs> and, and I might add that I did say that, you know, let's let's explore the world. And here's the third one in the United States. So our famous places for today seem to be New York centric. Um, okay, so we are on the uh, Jersey side of the, uh, yeah, there's Lady Liberty. There's New York City. Um, this over here, I believe, is <sighs> Newark, or here's the Statue of Liberty, here's Liberty Park, oh, Jersey City, yeah, the waterfront. Alright, so now we just gotta figure out how close we are to whatever. We're on the walkway. Um, if I'm looking southeast. I'm right on the middle of the path. That's the park. So, what do we think? Statue of Liberty. Now, we're right here on the water. So we're like in here somewhere, but I'm not gonna click just yet. I'm gonna see what I can find here. There's a road going up here. There's a path here. I'm not going to move from here. Uh, I'm going to just wing it because I I, I, I want to get to the point that I really don't have to move. I'm, I, I know generally where we are. Um, there's a road that sticks out here and then there's a little road here. So I got to think it's this thing. I, I got to think I'm in the right spot. But is Ellis Island in front of me? No. Oh yeah, there's Ellis Island. So I'm actually to the left. Ellis Island. So I am over here. If I'm looking southeast and then I'm looking here, so I'm right up there. 198 yards. Shoot. That's disappointing. Oh, damn it. Oh well. I would have liked to have been closer. I see the path. And there's the road there. That was the one thing I didn't look for. Oh. Dumbass. All right, so that's 4993. Um, I like this location, but uh, um, mm, the image wasn't that great. The scenic views were nice. There you go, because we saw Jersey City and we saw Manhattan and Ellis Island and the Lady Liberty. All right, hey, looks like we're out of the U.S. Okay, um, this would be uh, Stonehenge. I'm assuming that this is the only one like this. That Stonehenge, there's not a, you know, some other henge or stone whatever. Um, so we're going to assume this is Stonehenge, uh, which I've never seen. Um, geez, 
where is Stonehenge? Is it near London? This might take a little bit. Slough. Isn't that from the, uh, the Ricky Gervais office? Um, I guess I would assume it's in, you know, it's like one of these park areas. You can see how wide open this is here. And it's touristy. Jane Austen's house. Is it near Jane Austen's house? Farnborough. Is that the airshow place, Farnborough? Some of these names really stand out. There's a lot of stuff in here. What about all this? I mean, I, it could be north. For all I know, I mean, it could be... I'm just assuming near London because I think that's a people it's like a big tourist thing like you take the bus or whatever at the Stonehenge you're not going from London to up near like Scotland or something to to get to it right I would think it's like you know a, whatever an hour or maybe a little more than that drive from uh, London yeah see I'm way over here this is just ridiculous Oh, Woodhenge, Stonehenge. Is that it? That's it? Look. Prehistoric Standing Stone Circle. All right. So, um, let's see. Where are we on here? Um, I see a road here. I see a field here. I see a road that goes around. Um, there's a road behind me if I'm facing southeast there's a road right behind me so I, you're assuming it's either here or here There's a road right there. So there's that that goes out this way. I'm facing southeast, so and then there's one I guess over here. You can see it turning there. You can't see it from, from where you are, like here. Oh, shoot. Am I like right here? I'm right here in the stones. Fifty seven yards. Well, I'm just happy I found it. So I'm there. There's the road going that way. And there is a road over here, too. So, all right. Well, you know, whatever. Like that. Like the image. That was fine. Scenic. Okay. Um, next round. And I do believe this is five of five. Um, and we are back in uh, New York. And this is the uh, the World Trade Center. This is the um, the memorial from the old World Trade Center. So four out of five of these were United States. So I'm not going to say anything about the next one. So hopefully the next one gets us a little bit. I mean, I don't mind not getting perfect score on these if, you know, but I just, I like a little variety. Stonehenge is pretty good because it made me, made me look and think and all that, so... All right, Lower Manhattan. There's the World Trade Center. Whoops, right here. Um, there's the North Tower Pool. What's this one? South Tower Pool. So now I got to figure out which streets are behind me. Um,
that's this one here. So I'm assuming I'm over here, right? Right in here, because that's it right there. Street behind me here, but that's all that construction. I hope I'm not on the opposite side, but I'm pretty sure this is it. I mean, I know it's the World Trade Center, but I'm pretty sure that I'm at the right uh, thing. Although, you know, think about it. This might be this one. It might be this one. Like this is one here and then there's one over here. And again, I don't want to move. If I know what it is, I really don't want to move. So yeah, there, there, there can't be a pool back here. This is just a road. That's a road. That's a road. That's the corner over here. So this has to be the, uh, it has to be this one, right? 25 yards. Okay. Yep. It was that one. I was right at the very corner. Again, this thing marks it over to the little left here, and I'm like right in here. I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't think they're right on target because, I mean, I was standing right here because you could see the thing was right in front of me here, you know? I mean, if I'm wrong and somebody wants to point it out, then they can point it out, but it just seems to me like I was right in here and they're marking it over here at the corner. I wish you could kind of go back to what, you know, what you were looking at to, to see, but um, so this one I'm not going to, eh, I mean, it, it was good. That's fine. I'll be good. <laughs> I'll be nice. I think it's a little off, but that's fine. A couple yards here and there isn't a big deal. I got 5,000 points for that one. Um, easy to pinpoint. All right. So let's view our summary. So we got 24928. Um, a little disappointing, but, um, you know, I, when you consider that the Grand Canyon was one of them, so being a mile off in the Grand Canyon isn't the worst thing in the world. And three of them were in and around Lower Manhattan. So, okay, let's play this one again. All right, now we're cooking. Okay, one of five. This one, I have no idea. Um, let's see. Can I zoom in here? Can I zoom in here? Nope. We're going to have to walk because I have no idea what this one is. Um, I'm let's see how far this lets me go up here. And if you can hear those dogs barking in the background, there are a couple of strays that got loose um, that we saw when I took the kids to school this morning. And um, I think they're wreaking havoc in the neighborhood. And if you can't hear them, good. Nope, I didn't want you yet, map. Yeah, I'm going to need a sign that just tells me basically what this is because I really have no idea. Oh, there we go. And now I know what it is. It's the Taj Mahal. So this part of it, though, I don't... I, I Is this like the visitor center? <laughs> um, could be. You gotta come all the way out here to get it. So, where in India is the Taj Mahal? I should have paid more attention on the uh, Amazing Race. It's a big country. Is it, is it, you know, is it like, um, we just did, um, Stonehenge where I thought, okay, it has to be near London because it's one of those things that, you know, people that go to London that take the bus or whatever and go to Stonehenge. Is it like that with, um, 
one of the larger cities in India. Um, those roads, that's probably it. We're probably outside of India at this point, are we? Nope, not even close. All right, let's do this. Um, let's start here, start New Delhi. Seven Wonders Park. Isn't the Taj Mahal like one of the seven wonders of the world? Eiffel Tower, Statue of Liberty. Interesting. Uh, I'm I'm literally thinking from Amazing Race. Cities that I remember that they may have gone to. And I'm pretty sure they went to Kolkata too. Malls. I think it's near like a river. Some sort of body of water. I hope you have a river. Victoria Memorial. For, yeah, see there's all kinds of stuff. It's a big, big country. Agra sounds familiar. So does Kanpur and Jodhpur. Let's look at Jodhpur, Kanpur, and Agra. Agra sounds, that sounds like an amazing race. Jodhpur does too. And like I said, I think it's like along a river. I've watched every season of The Amazing Race, and, and my wife and I just watched, um, during the pandemic, we watched like 30 seasons on uh, Amazon Prime. So they do kind of blend together, but I think certain you know cities and names stand out. Uh, again, I think it's on the river. Oh, it's the Ganges River. Well, yeah, maybe that's, maybe that's it. Well, there's Agra, but that's not the Ganges. But Agra was the city they went to. Another one. I, I've hit every city that they've gone to. I'm pretty sure. I mean, for a while they were going every couple seasons. Um, all right, let's see what we got here. Oh, wait, Taj Mahal. It's right there. Right on the river. That's it. There's the garden. There's the entrance which I think is pretty much where we are. There's the Great Gate, there's the garden, and there's the Taj Mahal itself. There's the building. So if we go back to here, we're way back here. And then we are way, we started over here. We might have been back here, but we're here at the visitor center. Wow. All right, so that's there. That's the Great Gate. That's the entrance. Taj Mahal toilet. Um, huh, this is interesting though because here's the great gate, which is where I'm assuming we are, but when you look at it, it's a wide, long building. Here's the gate here. The gate is here. Are we really here? I mean, we're right on the, whatchamacallit? Taj Mahal toilet. There's a sign back there for a toilet. I didn't know, is it a famous toilet? I have a, I just, I'm just, I just don't want to be on the other side of the thing, you know? 
there's nothing else here. It's all garden. That's all garden here. If I go back over here, it's all garden. See, and there's the walkway. There's a walkway here. That's the gate, and the gate's going this way. So that's people coming this way. So then they go here. I'm just having a tough time believing this is like a strip mall. <laughs> you know? Hardware store. Really? On the other side of it, maybe? All right. Well, I think we're going to go with that. Let me see if I can find another trail over here. Here's a trail here. So I'm right here near the trail. So I'm by this trail. So I'm like right here. I think. There you go. 22 yards. Well, maybe I started. I didn't start in the grass, but whatever. I'm getting real picky about where they put these markers, but 22 yards. All right, we'll take it. Okay. Um, all right, let's see. Now we're up to two of five, and that looks like the capital. Um, I should know this. I lived in D.C. Um, spent a lot of time um, at the capital in that area. Um, long, long, long time ago. I mean, I was there in the 90s, uh, several years for like the 4th of July and all that, but I actually lived in the late 80s. Um, so it just depends on what size, but the side of the capital, but like, mm, all right, let's look. Washington, D.C., there's the capital. So here's the thing. So like you're over here, you got the Supreme Court, Library of Congress. I think we're on this side. See that there? And that there? We're facing northeast. That would be the Supreme Court there. That would be the Library of Congress. And then behind us would be the Capitol. And so we are across the street. Um... That's this East Capitol right here. So we're right here at the driveway for, here's East Capitol. So we're right here. So we're right, right, right here. All right, we'll go with this. 15 yards. Nice. nice. Round three of five. This is a landmark in Italy that I never, I have not seen. Um, lived in Italy for a couple years, um, but I lived in um, outside of Naples. This is not outside of Naples. This is uh, more north. Pisa. Right here. So, the question is, where is it listed in Google as Leaning Tower? Although that looks pretty straight to me. Right? Am I right on this? Is this is actually Leaning Tower Pisa? Is there some other Leaning Tower-esque... structure. Fourteenth century tower with a tilt, Torre di Pisa. So I'm assuming this is the only tower in Pisa with a tilt. Um, 
next to it would be this this would be the Museum of Opera we're facing north so that's actually this building here the uh, cathedral the, the Pisa that's there we're here there's a path going here um, although I always get screwed up on these paths, don't I? Here's the museum. I don't see anything here that looks like a path. I'm facing north here. Right? If that's correct, then I have to be over here. Like, I'm not that far away. I'm like right in here. But there's a path right here. That I'm assuming that that's... Although maybe that's... No, that's got to be it. Yeah, that's got to be it. So I have to be like right in here. If I look at this here, like right, I see here's the thing though. I don't see the damn cafe. There's a cafe there. No, that's the museum. That's the opera museum. That's over here. So it's actually over here. I think this is our path. Yeah, and this goes this way. So I'm actually over like here. Right? Four yards, yes. All right, see? I took my time, took a second, said, okay, I'm going to get these damn paths straight. Yes, because uh, that helped to look there, but that cafe, I didn't even know what the hell that was. None of this right in here. All right. Now we're up to four of five. Hmm. Isn't this interesting? Um, Great Wall of China. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Great. Huh. Okay. So... This is the Great Wall of China. We're facing southwest. No freaking idea. Where? Where is there a mile marker? I mean, how the hell do you figure this one out, right? All right, so we're we're not going to go that far. This one's going to screw me up. Unless it's like the beginning or something. Here's the... Or the end. Look at that. It goes up that way. Hmm. And I, I can't go up any further. I'm not liking this one. Yeah, see, I can go up here. I can't go up here. This is the end of it. And there's a tower there, so... Ah, who the hell knows? Well, let's see if we can go through here. Nope. There are probably hundreds of those little things right there. It's a bird's nest. That's a shame. I got a perfect score so far. And this is going to absolutely ruin it. Oh, and I can't go here. You know that. I'm wondering if that's the end of it. Or 
right? Oh, geez, I don't even know where the hell the thing starts. Probably north of Beijing, right? Because it's between Beijing and the, the Mongol hordes. Watergate, Great Wall. Commune by the Great Wall. The Great Wall. So, I'm thinking it's near the end of the, the Great Wall itself. There's skiing and all in here, so this is all kind of mountainous. I'm just going to pick a spot here because I don't know what else it would be. Yeah, I'm not... I'm just going to assume it's in this area and I'm going to take a point set for this. I don't know what the, what, um, if, if Google shows you where the wall itself is, like this here. Ugh. All right, we're just going to go with it. 30 miles. Um, so that's great wall to battling. Great Wall, yeah, the Great Wall runs all along here, and it doesn't uh, do anything here. Great Wall ticket office. So I was right that it was at the at the end, but unfortunately, I saw this in here and said, "Oh, there we go," because it was down here. But it actually went over here. So, all right. Well, unfortunately, that's a pretty good hit. That's a, almost a 1600 point hit. So, okay, five of five. Last one. Um, this is the Brandenburg Gate. Yes. I do believe so. Um, I was in Germany. Uh, well, I lived in Germany for about four years, and I was in Berlin when the wall was up in uh, 83, and I went through Checkpoint Charlie, which is right there, um, and um, I don't recall if I saw the Brandenburg Gate, but uh, Like I said, I did go to Checkpoint Charlie. Spent the day in uh, a day in uh, East Germany, which was fascinating. Um, so let's see, which side are we on? So that goes there. There's buildings over here, and then this goes this way, and this looks like a nice park area. So if we look out here, um, and yeet. And we are facing west, which means we're facing this way, which means we're somewhere in here. So let's go back. All right, so here's the gate. We are actually in the crosswalk. Here. Right? Yeah. So the gate's here. There's the arch. We're right actually about here. 17 yards. Okay, got my five grand. So, um, let's look at our summary. Hey, I'm a master tourist. All right, climbing up. Halfway through level seven, master tourist. Okay, so uh, 2348, again, a little disappointed, but um, you know, Great Wall China. Um, what do we have? Um, Oh yeah, we have Taj Mahal. That was a good one. Um, Brandenburg Gate, Lena Tower Pisa, and the um, 
uh, in front of the Capitol. So that was our, our, our five there. So I think that went pretty well. So that's going to do it for this uh, episode of GeoGuessr. Um, we got up to a level seven master tourist, so I'm very happy. Um, if you like this, if you'd like to see more of these, uh, you really, really help me out if you could uh, click like on the video. Um, and if you haven't subscribed already to subscribe, uh, YouTube likes to see those kind of things. So it'll recommend our content and that type of stuff and eventually um, get us monetized, whatever. Uh, so, you know, if you can do that and also click on the notify button, that way you will know when uh, another one of these comes out. But uh, I really enjoy the GeoGuessr ones and uh, I know I'm going to continue to do this for a while. So uh, hopefully you'll come along for the ride. Uh, until then, though, we will see you soon.